Hi, my name's Tom Elliott and welcome to this Financial Markets Update for Hodges Real Estate. Well, the Reserve Bank has left rates on hold again at 1.5%, but I've got to say, I think the trend in interest rates is up. Interestingly, in the past couple of days, the Canadian Central Bank has raised its official rate up 25 basis points to just 1% per annum over there. Uh, this has caused the Australian dollar to rally. It briefly went above 80 US cents. The perception in the markets is that the Australian economy was growing strongly and the US one was a bit weak. However, the June quarter GDP stats came out and they put paid to this notion. The Australian economy over the past 12 months grew at just 1.8% and this presents real problems for Federal Treasurer Scott Morrison. In order to pay back our growing national debt, he needs the local economy to grow at 3% per annum. It's growing at less than 2% per annum. Scott Morrison has some real problems. Uh, over in WA, they're thinking about seceding from the rest of Australia again. High iron ore and gas prices are making the West Australians feel very rich. They reckon they're being undercharged on the GST carve up. I don't think secession is really going to happen, but the Liberal Party over there is debating it at their state conference. Uh, here's an interesting one. Digital road signs on the Great Ocean Road are now giving messages in both English and Chinese. This underscores the importance of both Chinese tourists and Chinese investors to the Australian economy. And if recent auction action is any guide, Chinese buyers are still very, very active in our property market. Speaking of the property market, it is gearing up for the traditional spring selling season, although right here in Melbourne it is still well and truly wintry outside. Clearance rates are 74%, a little bit lower than last year. However, a lot more stock is expected to hit the market in the next few weeks. And remember, if you're thinking of selling or would simply like an opinion of value, be it for your primary residence or your investment property, contact your local Hodges office. Their experience can only assist you in the process, go to hodges.com.au.